Hey, welcome back tubers. It's a bit of a sad day. And I don't know if you can hear that, but there's a fault NE. So error code 82. I'm gonna say because that's a slave and that's the primary that this is doing something stupid. Uh, so I click the power off, it shuts down. That switch is actually turned off at the moment. That is on, that is off. Um, I've got one of the cables out here. I've been trying to troubleshoot this, but oh man. Five years, of more than five years, I will get the exact date of that unit and put it below. Editor Pete here. And on the screen, I've actually got the first video that I did with the 48 volt. And it was on, or about the 24th, 2016. I've had 13,000 views, 190 watch hours, 23 new subscribers, and I've made a whole $34.22. So there we go, over six years. Well, the third of August, August, well, six and a half years, almost seven years. Don't worry about my maths inside my head, but I can't complain about that, right? Um, I only turned it off because I was washing solar panels. So I was out 50 meters away in my shed roof and I thought I'll come and shut this down, wash the solar panels and then um, come and turn it back on again. And it just does that. It does appear to be a relay. He's trying to click on and then off. So maybe I can just replace the relay. I don't know. Um, HS, actually that one's not erroring now. Once I took those cables out, that one is not erroring. So that one's still working. So that's kind of a good thing, I guess. Anyway, tubers, this is not much of a short, but if you've got a, if anybody's got a, uh, what are they? A 4048MS in Australia. They'd like to sell me because they don't make those anymore. And I don't want to have to replace both of them. Hit me up. Uh, I would be very appreciative. Um, yeah. I can't even turn that one off because I haven't got that one isolatable. So I've got to actually turn both of them off. Ah... Uh, now, oh, what do you do? I guess that's why I put a transfer switch out there in the power box. I can just flick it over back to grid and I've still got power, so. And I've still got my main solar system for now. So again, if anybody's got one of those inverters, I would be much appreciative of um, grabbing it off you. I may actually have to take them both out and see if I can change that relay and see if it fixes it. Maybe that's a video. Anyway, tubers, thanks very much for tuning in and I'll see you on the next one.